girls need to know when to stop chasing after men who don't value them. Not every guy that likes you and treats you well like a gentleman is ready for a serious relationship. Men are like hunters, they are intentional with every action. If he really likes you and wants things to get serious, he knows exactly what to do. When a guy starts stalling and giving excuses at the time, when things are supposed to be getting serious, it is either he is buying more time for himself because he is not ready yet or because he is afraid to dump you and be lonely. Men are not dumb as women tend to see them. They are very calculative and intentional. Men who are not ready for a serious relationship are men who are not ready to commit. Commitment is a big ask, for anyone to fulfill this request he or she must be in the right frame of mind. What does a man need to be ready to commit to a relationship? It is imperative for every woman to know this. The truth is, there is no clear-cut answer to this question. But for most men, their career and financial status matter a lot. They need that financial security and financial freedom as their moral backing to be committed in a relationship. Some men are just greedy and irresponsible. They don't want to be burdened by the thought of knowing that they are responsible for someone's happiness. They just want to be free and committed to no one. Men especially those in their mid-twenties and early thirties get carried away by their age. These are the type of men who believe that marriage life starts at 40, forgetting to know that there is no right age to be in a serious relationship. Age on the other hand pushes women to do crazy things, like chasing after men who clearly do not have time for them. The man that has everything figured out and is still not ready to commit to you is clearly not ready for you. Men are opportunists, they don't just let beautiful things like you pass by, if they do it means someone else is on their mind. If a guy loves you, you don't have to stress to win his attention or need to remind him with your presence. If you are the one that is always there for him, constantly taking care of X and Y for him because he claims to be too busy, those are clear signs he is not yours to keep nor to take care of. You are wasting your time taking care of another woman's man. A man in love is driven by his natural instincts to protect his woman. If he constantly hangs you out to dry and is never there for you, the ship you are waiting for has sailed. It is time for you to disembark on that journey for your own good. When a guy starts stalling at the moment things are supposed to get real, it is a sign he is not ready for you. He might need a little push, but because of the kind of friends or company he keeps, he may be discouraged to try it all. If he spends more time with his friends than he spends with you, or always has one or two excuses why he should be with his friend rather than with you, these are subtle signs he is trying to get away from you. When the man you are with starts complaining unnecessarily, when there is nothing to complain about, or when he becomes mad at you for being too kind to him, or you witness an overall change of attitude, it means he is not ready for you yet. He is not ready to make the same amount of sacrifice for you or to be invested in you the way you have in him. When a guy is not ready for you, he turns to be nervous around you, skeptical, and very liberal with your actions. Most women see the liberal attitude of men to mean he is secure and doesn't care too much because he is confident. The real reason behind it is that they are setting a trap for you to fall into and give them an easy way out. Another clear sign that the guy you are seriously chasing after is not the one for you is when all he thinks about is his job. Most women chose to intentionally overlook this by falling in love with a guy at the peak of his career when all he has on his mind is his career. Such men don't have time for love, what they need is a distraction and somebody to help them take their stress off. The one mistake most women tend to make is that they convince themselves to stay in the relationship with the hopes of getting the man's attention once he gets hold of his career, which is never the case. When this happens, instead of quitting, they put up a fight because they can't just let their effort, time, and sleepless nights go in vain. If you are not actively engaged in the building process as an equal partner, forget it. You are working for another woman.